full moon in Aquarius is affecting Aquarius, Leo, Taurus, and Scorpio the most. Let's get into it. For all signs, your Mercury retrograde horoscope is already out. You can check that out through my links. Aquarius, this is your full moon. This full moon is a closing of a chapter when it comes to who you are and how you see yourself. This is especially true when you're comparing yourself to a relationship or partnership. You could be really reflecting on your past one-on-one -on -one relationships. May that be a romantic relationship, business partnership, or friendship. Seeing a past relationship in a new light. You could be getting some surprises when it comes to your home and family, but it's helping you understand your family patterns and how that's affecting your relationship patterns. You could Feel a little bit restricted when it comes to your finances, self-worth, and self-value, and how that's affecting your dating life and how you have fun. Having a huge internal shift in terms of understanding which relationships are best for you long term. You could be having some conversations about past issues with this full moon. You're saying goodbye to a past version of yourself, so remember to give them some grace and love. This full moon is helping you see are you being authentically you in relationships and how can you honor yourself. Leo, this full moon is the closing of a chapter when it comes to your relationships. May that be business partnerships, friendships, or romantic relationships. You could be saying goodbye to a relationship at this time or taking some distance, or you could be taking the next stage in a relationship. A relationship could give you a breakthrough or an opportunity when it comes to your career. You're feeling really motivated when it comes to your dreams, goals, friends, and community right now. However, it's giving you some tension when it comes to your finances, your self-worth, and your self-value. You could be setting a boundary with a friend right now, especially when it comes to what problems are yours and which problems are theirs. Ultimately, this full moon is helping you see which relationships really uplift you and motivate you and which ones aren't really best for your growth. Taurus, this full moon is a closing of a chapter when it comes to your career. You could be saying goodbye to a job or a manager at this time, or you could be featured or highlighted for the work you're doing. Gaining a new perspective when it comes to your home and family and how that's affecting the work you're doing and who you are. You could be feeling restricted when it comes to your friends, community, or goals right now and how that's affecting your finances, self-worth, and self-value. You. you could be setting a boundary with a friend or community. You could potentially surprise yourself with this full moon, especially when it comes to how you want to put yourself out there when it comes to your career, what changes you need to make in terms of your career and home life. Ultimately, this full moon is helping you see what legacy do you want to leave behind in this world. Scorpio, this full moon is a closing of a chapter when it comes to your home and family. You could be moving or redecorating at this time, getting a new roommate, one-on-one -on -one relationship, may that be a business partnership, friendship, or romantic relationship could really surprise you right now. This could help you get a breakthrough when it comes to your home, family, or career. And it also might make you change something when it comes to your home, family, or career. Are you feeling a bit restricted when it comes to your creativity, self-expression, children, or having fun and how that's affecting your friendships, community, but also your subconscious beliefs. This is ultimately helping you see more of what you're healing through from the past. Ultimately, this full moon is helping you see who you are at your core and which family patterns do you need to break. You wanna use this powerful full moon to your advantage and discover how it's impacting your chart specifically. Come join me for this event. We'll be doing a healing art ritual to release and let go of the past so that you can call in new energy. Replays are available. It's gonna be so much fun. I'll see you there. Comment down below your big three and what's been happening for you.